Right, hello everybody. She is all finished and oh, it just feels lovely in your hand. Yeah, what I did, um, I found a tie. It wasn't the same colour, but I've added it so that it's it added some, what did I put on it? Oh, chip sapphire. Okay, and it toned this one down and it just matched what was done on the cover there. Um, I might need to go through and get some, um, you know, threads, cut some of the threads off a little bit shorter. I'm not sure. I haven't double checked that. And I usually find things that I need to do when I do this video for some reason. But uh, that's all been hand, hand, machine done and hand stitched, okay? With, and, and it's all been hand painted bits of fabric in the background as well. I don't know whether you can see. Yeah. Okay, that was done by my sister. Just messing around, apparently. And I, I grabbed it because I said I just got to have that because it's so beautiful. Right, and what did I do to the on the spine here? Oh, I'd, I'd done it so that the things come out of um, the outside instead of the middle because I, I just felt as though I didn't want too much on here, just a little bit. So I just threaded some beads. These were um, handmade beads, paper beads, those ones there with a bit of resin on the top. And that's a handmade sort of dangle thing with a little flower there. This is um, like from vintage jewelry, this sort of thing. Those bits there. Okay, so that's that. It is lovely and I've got three of those on there's one there one there and one down here I think there's another one inside as well somewhere okay so there's three of those on there that you can see and this is just oh, I need to do this as well just to get rid of the threads <laughs> so I need to get this video done because I need to start the other journal and I've just threaded that through there spine there so you don't lose it okay and the inside I, um, I think I showed that in one of the first video it was felt that had a sticky back on it wasn't stuck to paper actually it was the backing from the actual felt that was tea stained so and I I've put a coat of I think it was like Mod Podge, something like that. Okay, so that's keeps that intact. All right, some of these things you might have seen me do in previous videos on 100 Day Challenge, I think that one was. And some of the tags that I've popped some of them in because they do go. So, and this is some artwork that I've done. I think that is a video out there. So, I wanted that little bit of blue to pop there. And I say there's videos on these sort of things. Okay, and I added some bits around the edges. I did a few bits in here. This is that was um it's quite a big pocket, so it needed something else in there. Uh it did hold it. Um, these are just oh the, uh, this is what I've been recently doing so I added one of those okay and just left it as in put that on the top and I actually thought that looked really nice so that could be made into something okay but it's just I've been recently doing that and I thought I'd pop that one in just went perfectly okay another of the tags that I've recently do, done there's videos on those okay and just journaling card there and then little snippet page snippet I think there's gonna be a video on that okay because it was like um it was to straighten the page out because when this was this was quite heavy and it sort of sort of clapped it made it look like it was not sewn in properly but it was the weight so I've sort of equaled out the weight a bit which has helped this was just hanging around so I put it over some embossed music paper with a bit of vellum over the top. So this was done in the 100 day challenge. Just 
pocket there I bought pages this was left over from um, was it these there's something I done anyway and that was left over from it so I just put a little tab on and then popped it in there okay so those is just little bits left over but got line paper on the back for journaling couldn't do any of that print than that I couldn't do anything with that page because um, I just really liked it. So, and that was the page tag there. It's all backed. And I actually don't mind. Do you know that normally I would cover those, but I actually didn't mind it this time. I think the, the colour was nice <laughs> and it went, so I left them. And then it stopped it being too um, thick as well. Uh, this is just bits that's been where it's been dyed <laughs> it's transferred onto that paper and left it because it looks really nice okay that's just a little top tuck or little envelope just a little German spot I left that as it is I, I just thought that looked really nice so I'll just tuck that in there another dangle there there's a video on those okay these are just bits that were left over from the, the kit and i've put line paper on the back and put them in and a little just left over bits come in handy that's not attached <laughs> video on this one okay. that was book page tags done there and just put a bit of journal card these you decorate you know yourself and put that in Make a little tag in there center of the signature tag in there and because I, this was already stuck in there but that bird looked really nice with that and because there was a lot of yellow and no yellow on here I just put a little bit of yellow washi tape okay and then we've got it there was blue in here but it's just that I needed to balance everything so oh there was the other dangle there on a bit of on a safety pin inside there so and then this is just a little little What's it called? They're called tippings, aren't they? There we go. That's that. And then that's the other side of the bag. Like I said, this was video on that. Another piece of paper. And it's just popped in. Yeah, line paper on the back. So you can write little notes and things. And that one there. A large jumbo tag there. Then a little tiny bit of collage there. A cluster, I should say. Yeah, um, tag I done recently using one of the flowers that I've done a long time ago. I've got a book with have a few in. Yeah, that I've done and I embossed them. There's a, there is a video on that, but there it is. I don't know. That's just a little stamp, a little bit of washi stamp cut around on a bit of handmade paper. On, uh, actually, I made that paper there. That's um, like an original. I might have done a video on that. I can't remember. But that was done on book pages. So that will be in the 100-day project. And I think I've done a, like a snowdrop painting with it because i made a little stamp so that's mine <laughs> mine 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 so that is totally original even the stamp i made <laughs> wasn't confident enough in drawing all those snowdrops do you know what i mean but with the stamp if i draw the stamp and then stamp it i'm all right this is just some little bits of paper that was left that's made into a journaling card that was the chip scoop. Need something behind there. That's 
you've got your tag and I just put a little bit there so I wasn't sure whether I liked the shape at the bottom so I just put that to cover it and now I'm all right with it so this is another bit that can um you can put things on yourself but it goes with everything so it's just one of my little um things I cut ages ago I think there's a template somewhere that you can do on your scan and cut I don't know whether it's in the Facebook group can't remember I mean I, I I've done so many things that I actually I, it's really hard remembering it all now so um this was oh a little bit of collage paper but I just saw it went oh and a bit of Tim Holtz got a bit of Tim Holtz haven't we <laughs> in there and I just and it's one of the things I've done out of bags yeah paper um, plastic bags just trying to recycle those so that goes in there oh what's in there is a cut there is something in the envelope if I remember rightly did do it up didn't we yeah yeah put that in there and we done I done like the watercolor effect on the inside so it's a video on that somewhere I think all the videos for this will be in the spring playlist which should be below yeah let's we really want to see that don't we bit so and we want to see that lovely robot robin wow so and we want to see that so let's rearrange that a little bit there i think that's good yep and then you've got your bits coming out the top that's perfect but there we go. And then just some plainish paper pages and then another one of those at the back with a nice big journaling card in. So most of the, the papers that were used in this was from the Freebies. Yeah, from Kofi. Done a big pocket on this side so I could get this in. Okay. So we could we could you could have it like that which is quite nice too or you could have it like that yeah actually I'm liking like that <laughs> yeah so I'm going to keep it like that now and then that's the back there we go all done and on with the very tone on tone thing I'm doing next with a bit of pink <laughs> I'm trying hard with pink that's what i'm doing <laughs> okay well thank you very much everybody and speak to you very soon bye